The Erie County Executive Brenton Davis spends a majority of his day in court today. Yeah, this after a woman filed two protection from abuse orders against Davis. One was for her. The other one was for her two children. Chelsea Swift joins us now live in the newsroom. She spent much of today in the courtroom. Chelsea? Sean and Jen, after more than four, five hours in the courtroom, the judge denied the PFA request. The Erie County Executive Brenton Davis appearing in court after a woman filed a protection against abuse order against him. The woman claims to be Davis's ex-girlfriend, testifying that Davis allegedly grabbed her by her clothing and threw her down to the ground and dragged her about 10 feet. That incident allegedly took place at his home on April 9th. The plaintiff claims this occurred after an argument over text message, which resulted in Davis blocking her cell phone number. In the courtroom this afternoon, they uncovered many messages over the last 16 months. The plaintiff's attorney says he is disappointed in the outcome and hopes that victims still choose to come forward. Davis's campaign manager says this hearing damages the reputation of all involved. It's time to put a fresh the sooner this whole thing can be forgotten, the sooner she can begin to reclaim and, and and repair her life because this is this has just done a lot of damage to her and I can tell you that Brenton was cognizant of that that is why he repeatedly tried to find ways to settle this without the spectacle that you saw in that hearing today and Judge Boyer is a retired judge from the Erie County Court of Common Plea. He had to take this case as all of the Erie County judges recused themselves due to the nature of this case.